right? We knew they was going to come out and fight. We knew they was going to play hard, right? We just had to settle it in and play our game, right? We got caught up in how they wanted us to play at the beginning. You know, them the defending state champs, right? So we knew they was, wasn't going to come out here and make it easy. So we just had to keep fighting. The, the talent is there, but the work ethic. You know, you have to, you have to play hard every minute that you're on the floor. And it's good to be coming around at that now. So um, we got to make some adjustments, but we, we live the... It's either, it's either win or go home and bake cookies. <laughs> Sometimes teams will throw their best punch early, and we know not to give up, and that's what happened. We, we took their biggest punch in the first quarter, and nobody put their head down. We came back and bounced. Uh, we came out and bounced back. We knew not to give up, just keep fighting. We got each other. It, it was easy for us. Was there a little something about coming down here and playing the defending state champs, too, you think? That's bracket? Was. Yeah, it definitely was. Two inner city schools from different parts of Ohio. Big game for us. We were all excited. It's Didn't talk about this for months we've been tested right you're gonna get tested in the tournament so we was able to be tested you know at the right times right that Brexville game was huge because we was able to come out you know play against some good competition some things we're gonna see in the tournament and it, it was good for us you know the different dynamic with this team this year is Ruel you know he brings something different he has experience going to a regional final last year it, it showed tonight he did a lot of the things that really made you guys move what has he been bringing for you guys Ru brings everything he brings like a stillness to the team, right? If you look at him, he never changes his expression. He's always calm and he knows what he's doing, right? He's a quarterback, right? So he's smart. He know everything that's going on on the court. He know where you're supposed to be and he know how to play the game the right way. Uh, it was easy. It was easy for me, especially I mean, I grew up with a lot of these guys. Know these guys since playing AAU against them, playing AAU with them. I mean, so we really finally for our, our last year got to play together. That not giving up. Where's that come from? You guys could easily have given it up, packed it in down 20 Five, seven. What, what was it about you guys not give it up? Yeah, that comes from uh, our coaches at practice. Uh, we start, we practice uh, down, but like we'll be, we'll be practicing down eight with two minutes left, having to get back in the game, fighting. Yeah, it's really our coach. They prepare us for moments like these. So in the game, it's really nothing, but we just got to work hard. Speaking of your coaches, you keep going for Coach Holt. What's happening for you guys? Yeah, man, Coach Holt, we all of them, legendary coaches, Holmes, uh, legend, Cleveland Heights, B.O. and coaching here back to back to back uh, districts, getting their uh, hope. Yeah! 30 years coaching. Yeah, all real legends. We just want to send Holt uh, out on a big state championship run for his end. Uh, definitely got to keep going for Coach. So, I mean, he does so much for this program, so much for the city, the community. This is all for him. Like I said at the beginning of the year, we want to send Coach Holt out with a bang, right? We want to do our best to make his last year memorable.